Starting out a new business is certainly a daunting but exciting venture and um, we know that many new business owners are overwhelmed with all the different processes they need to go to, such as where do I register for VAT or what do I do if I have a disruptive employee? What happens at the CCMA? Well, I'm joined on the line by Christo Burtis, whose organization has created a fantastic network to support budding entrepreneurs. Christo, thank you so much for joining us today. Good day. Yes, to your listeners. Now, as part of Business Partners, you've created the Entrepreneurs Growth Center. Tell us what the Growth Center is. Yeah, Jerusha, what we're trying to do is we've, we've got 34 years of history and, and we've been doing financing of small and medium businesses for, for that 34 years. We've built up a lot of uh, internal knowledge and we said, why not make that available to small and medium enterprises or, or entrepreneurs that contemplate going business or that wants to expand and they've got certain questions they want answered uh, and some of it might be just that little key that they need to to, to make the break and, uh, and and then we say but well let's let's open up uh, an entrepreneurs growth center uh, and we did that in October of last year and we to now had phenomenal success and uh, unbelievable growth because the people they 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 are hungry get help uh, on sometimes very plain simple things but sometimes very much in depth you know how can I, how can I do better and uh, and just in analyzing those those questions better, uh, we can we can uh, empower those entrepreneurs and what is what is more rewarding than empowering a, a small business can become more successful and, uh, and, and can contribute towards the, the great need of job creation in the country and, uh, and, and who's the job creators? It is the SMEs in our country. Now, since the launch of the Growth Center just a few months ago, you've had over 700 calls and, and requests for help from various small um, business owners in the country, this is really proof that something like this is really needed. Now, what are the typical struggles that you are dealing with um, as part of the Growth Center when it comes to, to small to medium enterprises in the country? What, what do we find those South African business people are really struggling with? Yeah, they, often they, they have a business plan and it's, it's their thoughts put together on paper, but maybe there's there's some gaps in it you know and they they, they don't get finance at the financiers uh, finance houses because got an incomplete business idea they they um, they don't have the, the the thing put together on paper properly and uh, and then we just go through it uh, point by point and we say well well uh, what about this? Your marketing plan is, is not really thought out very well. Uh, what is uh, your product? Is what is what is it? Is it going to make it special against other products that, that's already on the market? How can how can we we uh, make it better? How can we use or, or tap a certain niche market? And uh, and in discussions with the, the entrepreneur, we we actually. We, uh, just refine their, their plans and uh, uh, in that they they actually uh, get empowered and uh, I've got a number of cases where they did exactly that and uh, then they were able to obtain finance and they could make a, a great success of it whether it's from a bank or whether it's from business partners or or another venture capitalist or, or whatever uh, so yes there's also niggling questions that they don't know. Where do I go to for this or that or the other? How, uh, you know, is the price that I'm paying for my business is it a fair price? And uh, and then uh, we can we can do with our knowledge. We can quickly work out and we can say, well, you are overpaying on this. Now, Christo, you also have plans to expand this network. Talk to us about how that will work. Um, yeah, we. 
we think that there's many very, very good service providers uh, that, that can add real value to entrepreneurs. And we just feel uh, very strongly we must accredit those, those service providers and, and make it possible for entrepreneurs to, to, to uh, make use of a much larger resource than just ours. And, um, and, and I, I am giving you one example. There's, there's people that can help you to register a company at a minimal cost. And uh, if you do it yourself, it, it, will, it will take you quite a bit of time. Uh, they can do it very quickly. Some of them have a turnaround time of two days to get, get your company registered. Uh, and, and, and even that registration at, at SARS in getting your employees registered, in uh, in in uh, getting getting your property uh, property transferred into your name, uh, just just uh, working on your marketing plan and refining it better. There's consultants, there's mentors uh, that work at a at a very competitive rate, uh, and sometimes much discounted rate, just because they want to plow back uh, to uh, SMEs. And, and see them thrive and get the, the kick out of it that they are successful because I've made a small contribution towards their success. And, uh, and, and that is our attitude also. We, we're not doing business for free, but this service that we render uh, is actually there to, to help entrepreneurs and, and hopefully they would remember us in, in, in at times when, when they may be qualified for business, uh, other business with business partners. Christo, how can a budding entrepreneur make use of this service? How can they contact you to find out more? Yeah, there's, there's various ways. There's, a, there's a, a, a number that you can dial, 0861 SME FIN, uh, which is, uh, which is the, 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 the nice, nice word. Then they can also get onto the inquiries at businesspartners.co.za. There's also a Twitter feed. Uh, at Biz Partners, Biz with a Z, uh, Limited, uh, LTD, and um, and they can they can ask their questions, and there would be somebody that can promptly answer that, and uh, and if it's a more in depth question, it could be referred to a, a, an expert that can uh, that can advise them. Well, Krista, we'll put um, some of your tweets below this video for our viewers to go and check them out. Thank you so much for joining us today, and we sh we're pretty sure we'll be catching up with you soon in the future. Thank you, Jerushua, and welcome. <laughs>